I'm Michelle Linden Mayer and in this video I'm going to show you how to mat your photos. One of the easiest and most effective ways to make your photo stand out or have definition is with a photo mat that has been cut from a piece of cardstock or pattern paper. How wide or thin or how many mats you would like your photo to have is up to your imagination. What you need, you need a photo, a piece of cardstock, a pencil, a ruler and a paper trimmer. Firstly, place your photo down in one of the corners of your piece of cardstock and decide how wide or thin you would like to have your border. You'll then need to take your ruler and measure the width of your border. Take your pencil and ruler and measure and mark the same distance from your photo on the other two sides. For instance, if your border is half an inch on the top and side, you'll need to make a mark half an inch from your photo on the bottom and other side. Now you can put your photo to one side for the time being. Take your photo mat and place it into your trimmer and cut where you have made your marks. Some paper trimmers also have built in measurements that you can use. If you are unsure on how to use a paper trimmer, please watch the video on how to use a paper trimmer. Your photo mat is now ready for you to adhere your photo. As you become more experienced as a scrapbooker, you will find that you will probably be able to judge by eye the amount that you need to trim from your photo mat without having to measure beforehand. You may also like to do more than one mat under your photo by graduating each one in size to really make your photo stand out. I'm Michelle for Scrapbook TV. Happy scrapping! Mm -hmm.